That was a close call. I'm happy you're still here. I dodged the huge bullet there. Chris seems pissed. That's perfect for us. If he's mad at Meech and Michaela, he won't target us next. We just need Meech and Michaela to vote with us and get rid of Chris if we lose again. Last night was the first time I felt like crap I might be going home. But I am still here and I'm going to win the million dollars. How do you feel about the vote last night, Chris? I'm going to be personally honest. I knew you were behind that the whole time. So I'm pissed. She had to go. I don't really care, Meech. You blew your trust with me. I had your back. And you totally betrayed me. Well, I'm sorry. Meech is dead to me in this game right now. I know it was mainly her that was behind the Wentworth vote. So, her trust with me is gone. And right now, I'm going to do whatever I can to make sure that if we go back to Tribal Council, she goes home. So if we go back to Tribal Council, you're going to vote me out? Why wouldn't I if you betrayed my trust? Chris is coming at me hard for voting out Wentworth last night, and honestly he's a big dude so I can't mess with him but I know that he's coming for me. So I need to get rid of him if we lose. Hey guys. Joe and I have tree mail. Read it. Okay. It says here. 14 left what a milestone. And every twist and turn the game is changing. A twist could be lurking? Hold tight and you'll find out soon. That's refreshing. It could be the pre-merge because it said 14 people and milestone. I mean, who knows what it is? It's Survivor Game Changers. Century's throwing twists and turns at us everywhere. I wasn't expecting to get swapped as early as we did. It could just be another twist. I have honestly no clue what this twist could be. It could be the pre-merge or something else that's never been introduced before, but I'm scared. Whatever it is I hope it doesn't send us to Tribal. I mean, it, I hate to say it, but it could be something that could send us to Tribal because we've been winning challenges. I doubt it would be though. Let's just wait it out. Hi Paul. What are you making? Rice and fish. It's ready now. It's clear that I might be the next one to go. I have an idol but still I'm nervous. So I'm trying to cook the tribe food to be good. And to show the tribe that there is a benefit to keeping me. How is it guys? It's amazing. Thanks Paul. No problem Marco. I can't stop eating this. It's amazing. You like it? I feel it's undercooked. There's one thing about Ernie which just pisses me off. He's just very negative and he only thinks about himself. Today he had to mention that he thinks the fish is undercooked. He doesn't know that this is making himself a bigger target than he actually is right now. And what pisses me off the most is that he comes from Sesame Street which is all about positivity and he's showing negativity. If we go back to Tribal, I'm going to play my idol and hopefully it will send Ernie home. Today is the pre-merge. The 14 contestants will be divided into two new tribes of seven. The tribes will be Mana and Nuku. Tavua is no more. The pre-merge Mana tribe includes Michaela, Brad, Joe, Jessica, Ernie, Cassandra and Paul. And the pre-merge Nuku tribe includes Chris, Natalie, Demeters, Spencer, Meech, Marco and Alicia. We're going to have a reward challenge right now. The winning tribe earns fried chicken and mac and cheese while the losers win nothing. Congratulations Mana. You guys are the first tribe to finish. You guys have earned fried chicken and mac and cheese. Enjoy. I'm sorry but Nuku. I have nothing for you guys. You guys can head back to camp. Welcome to or back to Nuku guys. It's great to have you here. Meech and I have been at Nuku the longest right now. And since, because we've been at Nuku the longest, I thought it would be nice for one of us to welcome the tribe, and I decided to do it. Not surprised Meech decided not to do it, because Meech doesn't have any trust. And she's trying to get trust by being quiet. What's up, Natalie? OMG, I'm so freaking excited to be on the same tribe as you. Meech and I played on Big Brother 18 together before coming out here. 
so I was super excited that I am on the same tribe as her. I trust her the most out of everyone in this group. Who are you close with from your old tribes? Probably Spencer and Demeters. I've always gotten a good vibe from Spencer. He was loyal to me on Mana. I was close with those two. I also like Marco. He is loyal. All I know about Marco is that he was the second one out of his season. He's wanted this chance and he wants to go far. He's a good player. The only person I have a problem with is Chris. He's a lot more arrogant than he was on season 2. He seems that way. Alicia was talking about him on Mana. I feel they are tight. They were on original Nuku. It was me, Marco and Ernie on the bottom. Right now I need Chris to stay the target so I can send him home. I feel good with this me, Natalie, Spencer and Demeter's plan. And if we can get Marco to come aboard with it too. That would be amazing. So I'm good. Let's dig in. The mac and cheese is so fresh. I freaking love fried chicken. Especially KFC. Wait, Joe, you still eat fast food? I thought you told me you were over fast food. Yeah, I still do. Try not to lie. Joe and Brad's relationship in this game is scary because they are both huge and smart guys. Right now I need the viewer to stay tight and get rid of one of those guys. How do you feel about the group, Paul? I trust you and I trust Cassandra so I feel better that I have you guys. But I don't know where we stand. I feel that we need Mikaela to vote with us to get the power. We have to get rid of one of the Mana 3. I'm good with that. Joe and Brad are more dangerous right now but I'll do anything. Those two have been tight since day one. I think Jessica trusts them. I have absolutely no friendship towards Jessica after she blindsided me on season 4. Jessica got rid of you. Final 7 she blindsided me with William, Elena and Keyshawn. If you want Jessica out, I'm fine with that. Personally, I was pissed when I saw that Ernie was on the tribe with me. But I need to work with him if I want to get to the merge. It could have been better but could have been worse. How are you feeling about the group Brad? I mean right now, I don't know where we stand in this tribe. We're definitely not in the same position that we were in the last Mana tribe. We have Jessica. But that's only three, Joe. I don't think we have Cassandra anymore. She's been hanging with Paul and Ernie since we got here. We need Michaela. When I look at the numbers on this pre-merge Mana tribe, I see three Mana, three Tabua, and one Nuku. So right now what we need to do is have the three Mana pull in the one Nuku and get rid of the Tabua. Hopefully that would work. Welcome Mana to your next immunity challenge. Welcome Nuku to your next immunity challenge. Congratulations Nuku. You guys were the first tribe to finish. No tribal council for you guys. Good night, Mana Tribal Council tonight where one of the seven of you will be voted out. See you at tribal. Well guys that sucked. Back to tribal council again. The net was heavy. For my safety I had to drop. But it does suck to have to go back to tribal. Who should we get rid of out of those three? Joe and Brad need to be split up before the merge. It comes down to Jessica versus Brad for me. I have no clue when we're merging. We should keep Joe and then when we merge cut him there. I'm fine with that. I feel good with the plan tonight between Jessica and Brad. Hopefully Michaela will stick with us and we can vote one of those two out. It feels good to have the numbers and have control and to be safe. Who is to view a voting for tonight? It's between Jessica and Brad right now. As far as I know you're safe. It feels good to know that I am safe tonight but I'm worried for Jessica and Brad. They are my closest allies and if one of them goes I know that I will be next. What's wrong Joe? You're not going to be happy. Michaela told me that Cassandra, Ernie and Paul are planning to vote one of you guys. They're planning to vote either Jess or I. Happy. Not happy at all. Because if Ernie, Cassandra, Paul, and Michaela all vote me or Jess, one of us two goes home tonight. And for my game, that is bad. I cannot have that happen. I'd like to get rid of Cassandra. She had our backs and then totally lied to us by working with Paul and Ernie. I'll talk to Michaela. 
and see if I can get her on our side. And because I'm totally, I agree. Taylor, in this game, who are the people you'd want to play with? The the strong or the weak? I'd much rather work with the strong than the weak. Why are you asking? Because I know that Ernie, Paul, and Cassandra are targeting me. Who are you thinking of taking out? Cassandra. The main reason is, she betrayed me. We were working together in the beginning, and then when she went to Tabua, she lied to me and worked, started working with Ernie and Paul. So she has to go. Brad makes good points. Cassandra has lied to people and is very manipulative. She could manipulate a jury into giving her the title. So maybe Cassandra needs to go and we keep Brad. But Brad has the full package. He is really strong and smart. He could beat everyone in the merge. So I'm 50-50 on who needs to go Brad or Cassandra. It's a toss-up. It's time to vote. I'll go get the votes. If anyone has an idol and would like to use it now is the time to do so. Okay once the votes are in the decision is final the person voted out will be asked to leave immediately. I'll read the votes. First vote Brad, Cassandra, 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 Brad, Brad. Seventh person voted out. Cassandra, Cassandra. The tribe has spoken. Grab your torches head back to camp. Good night.